Hey guys, what's up and welcome back. So this is actually the first video I'm doing of tabs right now. So um, what I really wanted to do was just, you know, play around because in Fortnite I'm getting bullied a lot and um, by these just these sweats. And um, uh, I wanted to do something new. So we're doing tabs. So in the recent update, they added in the Reaper. You know, there's a bunch of cool stuff you can do. Uh, there's a Da Vinci tank. <sighs> and that's how strong it is. So, okay, now if we look at this, we actually have a full list of uh, campaigns. So I'm thinking, let's try out a few of these. So we've got, um, you know, uh, like a few of these levels, you know. This is just to have like complete fun. Oh, rival captain. Okay, so we can use all of these things uh, to our advantage. I think we got the we got the berserkers going in. They're moving in on the uh, captains, and you know what? I think my balloon archer strategy is working out pretty well. If we can just get those guys in the sky. Yep. See, see that? See that? That the captain is literally flying. You know what? Captain Hook always wanted to have a flying ship, and this is all you need. Look at that. Oh my gosh, absolute domination. We've got board the ship. Harpooners, bomb throwers. Okay, so it's going to be hard to board the ship. I, I think defending, it's a lot easier than uh, attacking, but you know what the weakness to these guys are? I think it's range, so you know what we're going to do. And we're also going to use musketeers their full advantage which is range and you know what I think that's gonna work Wow come on guys don't let the captain get to you oh yep the harpooners are pulling them oh and they're already dead oh and then there's this these cannons that don't know how to move right and we'll get a front row seat. Okay, we got one of them. Oh, two of them. Nice. One more. Oh, oh, it's taking substantial damage. Come on. Alright, just end this man's whole career, please. One got to him. Oh, and that'll be the victory. His cannon finally broke. And let's see the chaos unfold. Ooh, the berserkers jumping in. Alright, and it looks like this might be an easy victory for us. Considering that the headbutters are just going to run into... Well, that's anticlimactic. Okay, well, they're just gonna surround them and beat them up. Well, unless friendly fire happens. Oh! Conked in the head with an axe! Traitors. Ah, so you got the four guys in the middle that are like betraying you, and then you got the guys on the outside. Well, you know what? I think the best way to handle this is with crowd control. But can dodge shots and um, all sorts of that stuff. Look at that. The sheer number of painters. Look at this. It's just a bombardment of painters. My frame rate drops slightly. One thing pirates are good at is numbers and this guy he don't got a lot of numbers right now being in numbers that has a bunch of cheap units and is good at you know being in numbers defend the captain the captain can die right nothing wrong with the ring of berserkers and they're just gonna jump out they're going to hopefully destroy the cannons distract the bomb throwers yep all of the bomb throwers are down so wow how easy is this game? I thought this game was really, really hard. Okay, defending the queen. Okay, eat my muskets. Oh, the sheer amount of firepower that just happened right there was absolutely insane. Up, oh, yup, the captain got yoinked. Bro, the captain got yoinked away. Those harpooners just chilling in the back, just like, oh, one's hooked onto the queen's like, that is the same harpooner. What the flip? Bro, with the help of the harpooners, nope, there's absolutely no way. <laughs> harpooners MVP for our team. Alright. 
All right, so I thought about it and I was thinking, wow, what can we use that's good for crowd control? That isn't a bunch of crowds. And I thought to myself, well, mammoths are, they, they, they cost a lot and they don't have a lot of health, but they sure are good at crowd control. So I guess that wouldn't make them real good. They just got hit in the side and then they're, they're down, okay. Another strategy, we charge at them. And we simply just, you know, just, just, just you know, try and destroy their lines with cavalry. Whoa, that horse, horse and knight, go, go, horsey, oh, nope, and that knight is dead, oh. Hit right through the armor. Let's just see what one long ship does. Okay, okay, we're getting somewhere. What about four long ships? They instantly throw their troops directly up in the air. I guess that'd be good for distra- Oh my gosh. This guy just got crated in the sea. Oh my, oh my. So I thought, can't samurais block arrows? What if they could block projectiles and I was right. They can block bullets. They can block bullets. Okay, so we're just gonna mass mass samurais here. They can't do nothing. Ninja's still up. And defeat. Okay. Let's see what happens. We got a bunch of shurikens. I'm hoping that... What is that ninja doing? Alright, well I'm hoping that these guys can, the samurais can distract while the uh, five ninjas that I have are going to just absolutely destroy the enemy formation. So I'm hoping that the captains are going to go down soon. And now I think it's just these little ninjas. That guy just got kicked to the side. Oh, three ninjas. Three ninjas remain. Lots and lots of shurikens. Just keep going with the shurikens. Oh, up, up, up. They're getting hit hard. There's one ninja left. One ninja left. Okay. Well, you know, we could always just shoot them up into the air with a bunch of balloons. Look at that. They're so happy. That guy's got a balloon in his leg. So, I think balloon archers is definitely the way to go. Balloon archers. Okay. What if we mass balloon archers? We don't have many balloon archers left. The harpooners are starting to pick them off, but we do have seen we've gotten most of their lightweight guys. So after that, it's just going to be the pirate queen, these just one captain, two captains, and three harpooners. Dang it. That is, wow, that is a lot of hit points. So we're going to fire in the snakes, and they're just going to be, the lightning is going to bounce, and they're just going to be too busy trying to trying to get rid of the snakes. They're not even going to uh, try to, yeah, see those grappling hook guys. By the time the snakes are actually gone, there'll just be more snakes. Fire! Oh, nope. And these snakes are being kicked off one by one. It does not look like this is going to end well for Zeus and his army. I forgot that Zeus was kind of a terrible unit for 2000, so this time we're going for the Minotaur Charge! Oh wow! Three Minotaurs going in there right off the bat. Three Minotaurs versus two captains, and the one Minotaurs are down, and both captains are still up. Oh, looks like the Minotaur is just getting picked on by the captain. Oh, and that is, that's defeat. Um. What if we tried catapulting and also healer strategy? I heard that healer works kind of well. Oh, wow, blowing up our own units, are we catapults? I heard that healing works really well for like some of those things. So we're gonna try a healing strategy. And oh no, oh boy, oh. Just, just keep on healing it, just, oh. No, we're out of healing. Oh no! Fire at will! Oh! I'm not sure that's the queen's name, but it's in a 1v1, and that 
is victory. You just got destroyed. <laughs> oh, a small tribe. Okay, so now we can only use the pirate faction and we must destroy these guys. So, I'm thinking we have enough for a pirate queen. Pirate queens are strong. We definitely know that. Oh, what? Just takes out those chieftains. One shot. Oh, and then he's got the yep bombs in the sky, brother. That's exactly when the stone. Oh, kicked in the sky. Yeet. Oh, bro, just absolutely out finessed. The pirate queen single-handedly did. Did you see how much like a roundhouse kick, man? Okay, we've got another small tribe. Okay, the, another small tribe. Yeah, great variety of naming you got there some fodder to uh oh yep those chieftains just got wrecked and oh yep another shot of the cannon equals another digity do oh nope and now they're going in oh okay boom and they still give us good firing rates oh that bomb thrower you did not do your job man Oh, well, the captain certainly is doing his job. Hit one guy. Oh! <gasps> Did you see that? And the bomb throwers. Wow, Sesame. Alright. Oh. <laughs> that cannon is so good. You know what? We have enough for a cannon. Let's buy a cannon. <laughs> it's totally not just gonna, you know, absolutely nail that thing oh flip you're aiming off to the side little guy you barely hit anybody you absolute not so good that cannon he's he's drunk right now he's drunk you know just, just no no birds birds you better stop the birds birds i'm telling you you better come on bro come on bro you can do this yes Oh my gosh, wow, that came down to the wire. All right. Then we've got, yep, all the bombs, they're going in. And then there's the Pirate Queen, which hopefully is going to be the main contributor. Oh yes, yes, the Pirate Queen is almost single-handedly taking these guys out. I do not know how much more health she has. And she's, she's a bit above half. Oh yep, absolutely wrecking them. Oh yeah. Oof, look at that. You know what? Noble sacrifices to those who threw the bombs at their feet and decided, I'm gonna die, but it's for a better cause. Oh, we need to spread out our fodder a little bit better, guys. Spread out our fodder. Then we'll just have an even more foddier fodder. At their feet. I can't line up your shot. Oh, takes out a knight one shot to the face. Line up your shot. Another night down. Line up your shot. Fire. Another night down. Wow. But fire. What? What would you? Do? Look, it's the one blunderbuss. Oh, hit in the leg. This is the greatest thing about blunderbusses. They have armor, so they can last for practically ever. Die. If I go down, you're coming down with me. Oh, whoa. Okay, bro. <laughs> Perfect! This man! He has done something offensive! Three cannons. Let's see what this is. We're just doing a rough draft. Oh, yep. Hits directly. Okay. Then we've got these, these guys. Just... Okay, so the cannons doing amazingly to take them out. Okay, good. Just perfect. Just absolutely. Okay, start. Okay, now let's see. Oh, wait. Oh, dang it. They targeted the middle, kind of. Kind of. What happened to this man? Start it. Must see. Oh, I see what happened to that man. And then all of the archers got blown up. That is the best part about it. Okay. Oh, boom! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Holy cow, that is an absolute siege machine. 
you could hit the castle gates and they fall right down. Yep, so perfect um, job at baiting the uh, queen. Bomb throwers, you did an A minus job. You did a C minus job. Absolutely. You know what? Pirates were never that good at school. I don't think I should give them grades. Well, you know what? The bombs did kind of well here. You know what? Overall grade, this grade, you did a, a, a an A A job. I'm giving you an overall B grade. Uh, an overall grade of a B. You know what? Because that's cool. I mean, it's really nice. Oh. Shotgun to the face, boy. What are you doing? I'm deleting you. are obviously a glitch. I am deleting you and repasting you because I don't want a glitched unit in my battle. That's just why I, I, I do not want that. They're great at getting out of the way when they need to. Just like that. You know why? Oh, wow. Okay. There may be some... Nope, never mind. There will not be any flanking. Now, the best part about the bomb throwers is that they're like glass cannons that just clean up work. Boom! There is that occasional exception where they do get hit by a ballista and they can do nothing about it. That is how we do it. Flint locks at the back to meet those berserkers. Jared, you idiot. I need to select this guy. This this guy is of utter importance. And fire. Good job, Jared. Did well. Fire. Okay, that wasn't enough to bring down the Jarl. Okay, okay. Fire. How much health do these Jarls have? I'm starting to I'm starting to I, I think I found a glitch. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. There's no way I found a glitch. With the power of blades on harpoons. Unless, of course, we get absolutely outmatched and slaughtered. Look at this guy. That guy had a tiny head on his huge body, and he just got absolutely wrecked. What would happen? Would. Clearly, this would definitely happen. This is exactly what would happen if uh, if we had a um, uh, if we had this formation. You know, this is exactly what would happen. We're gonna make a little ring-shaped thing for them, so that uh, they can, you know. You know what? That was almost an absolute waste. What does that say about our? Tactic. <laughs> what does that say about a tactic? It's all wrong, obviously. Berserkers are amazing at destroying units. I had to try it just for fun. What would happen if you add 61? Look at that. There's a bunch of crossfire. If you had 61 flint locks, what would happen? This would happen. What would happen then? Well, the cannon would be wrecked by that, and the I, uh, the queens would be slayed. Almost, they'd blow things up, and then they'd get wrecked. Right? Is that correct, or is that that is absolutely wrong? Other stuff right there. Boom, and then get out of the way because we got bombs coming in. I give my bombers three and a half stars. You know what? Make that three stars. We still won. This side did most of your job, but still needed a little bit of assistance in the end. Hey, there goes the Monkey King. Hopefully, hopefully that's where the Monkey King went. I think. Okay, good. It's not our Archer Queen that fell inside the hole. But our Archer Queen is not down. Not just yet. Use your... He shot. And Karma got him in the foot. That's what I'm gonna do. Okay, that's good. That is actually really good. We took out a Samurai. We took out a Samurai. We took out... 
Wow, that guy just got flung out of the arena, and I don't even know how. Hey, the monkeys, they're jumping in, and they just threw a dead captain down the hole. I have now established a very established army. What is wrong with these cannons? I don't know, but I'm gonna make them fire! Fire, you fool, fire! Oh no. Look at that monkey piece out of the picture. Oh! That guy's gonna have back problems for weeks, man! That guy just got destroyed. And it worked out. Whoa, fly fireworks going all over the field! That guy's got rockets on his feet, man! Rockets on his feet! Okay, it looks like we're doing good on a few fronts, and our king, our dead, our, our dead um, captain just got pushed into the river. Dang it. Those dang ninjas, I do not like. Retreat! Retreat! There are too many! What a weakling. We have two at the top defending very well against this threat. There are only two monks left and we are slowly going to get them. We, there's only one monk left and he will be soon dealt with. He will probably knock this guy out. Wow, how does this guy have so many hit points? He has to be, well he's got a bunch of hit points but he doesn't have any that, you know, he doesn't have a lot of damage. And begin! Fire in the hole! And fire! Perfect! Just like we said they would, they dragged dead guy's foot. And now we have a harpoon versus Calvary. A devastating battle that will most likely result in the harpooner's death. The harpooner's fishing trip with ballooners. They're fishing for balloons. And as we hear it, these ballooners are the best source. Of Here comes the last one. Double ring and in. Go, 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 go! Archer Queen, make it to the enemy lines! Disrupt their units! Destroy them! Destroy them! Got them good! Jump into the air! Do that little squirty thing you do! You know what? I don't even care about these guys. I'm going straight to these, these brothers over here because I actually care about them. How are these guys doing? You know what? You make me very angry, boys. You make me very angry, boy. Come here. Alright guys, well that will be all for this Taz video. It looks like we absolutely completed and slammed through that pirate campaign all the way through to the boom and the units go down so i hope you enjoyed this tabs video like and well definitely share with friends but uh comment down below if you would like to see more tabs videos and i'll see you guys next time bye bye